All right, hey guys, welcome again to Fire Alarms and Such, and it is time to show, demo, and compare an LED fire alarm. I finally got one. This is the Edwards GL Series Genesis LED Multi Candela Horn Strobe. This is the LED alarm that we are going to be talking about today. Over here is the System Sensor Spectre Alert Classic set at 1575 Candela strobe only. This is running horn strobe because that is a two wire device. This is running strobe only because it is a four wire device. Everything is completely dark around me because we're going to be doing a strobe comparison because it's really cool. I think I like LED strobes better than um, xenon tube strobes. There are definitely some similarities, some differences, some pluses, some minuses, but we are going to dive right in. First off, this is the device here. Again, this is the EST Genesis GL series with the LED you know, you have your multi candela selector over here. There's just a little switch in the back. And then over here, there's another slider switch for low high coded and low high continuous. So here's how this is going to work. I have all my NACs disabled. Actually, let me disable that. Turn that off. And so all of my NACs are off. We're going to throw a supervisor in the panel. And this is what happens. Oh my God, I just silenced the panel the wrong way. I meant to acknowledge the supervisory. There we go. Okay. So we'll acknowledge that so we don't keep on getting beeps. And so this is the way that this is gonna work. All my NACs are disabled right now. I'm gonna shut off my only light down here that's on right now. And we're gonna go, shut up. We're gonna go stand over at the enunciator. And we're going to enable, this is on NAC1, this is on NAC4. So we're going to run each strobe one at a time, and then we're going to run them together. So, let's plunge us in to the internal pit of darkness here. Ooh la la. I do have one light on in the back just so I can actually see where I'm going. So we're going to come over here to the enunciator. And we are going to enable the LED strobe. So that was the LED strobe. You saw it had a very, shut up, it had a very slow flash. Um, it was more blue than white, which was kind of interesting, but the flash rate, it stays on longer and it's not as intense. And these are set to pretty much the same candela, um, but it's interesting. It's a lot, it's a really, I'm trying to think of the word, it's a lot calmer. It's a lot gentler. It's a gentler strobe. Like it's not just bam right in your face. It's on off, on off. So let's turn on the xenon tube. So this is the xenon tube. You can see it's a more intense sudden flash. There is also a difference in how the camera picks up the strobe too, which is kind of interesting because the LED stays on for longer. So the camera can pick it up easier, which is another plus. So now let's enable both strobes. Oop, wrong one. Not bad. I'm trying to see. Are they seriously flashing in time? Okay, so the strobes are flashing in time right now. I don't know how I managed that. 
But you can see the LED one is being caught by the camera and not so much the xenon tube. It stays on longer. Let me real quick turn off the xenon tube and turn it back on and hopefully That's a little bit better. It's a little off. There, I separated it a little bit more. You can see the LED is the one that stays on longer, so it's going to go LED, LED, LED. The uh, Xenon tube is the one that's just a little bit behind. But the LED one is, is flashing with the horn. But you can totally see that the camera is picking it up so much better. So, we just did some comparisons of, shut up, an LED horn strobe and a xenon tube horn strobe. These are becoming increasingly more popular in the fire alarm industry, and I have seen a couple in person, and it's really cool to see these start to be put in place. I really want to get a Wheelock one, one of the LED Wheelock exceeders. This is an uh, EST LED. I really, really want to get one of the Simplex LED True Alerts. Uh, those have not really hit the residential market yet, but... I really am liking these LED devices. So, thank you guys for watching, and as always, have a wonderful day.